father very much believed in making this world a better place. So I used to go with him visiting what I call these little old ladies. We'd bring them flowers, we'd take them to the grocery store, we would bring joy to their lives. So I started at a very early age to try to make this world a better place. I very much believe in the future to really create the joy of Jewish living, giving, and learning, and to make this world a better place. I think there are four values that undergird everything we do at the Schusterman Family Foundation. The first value is a commitment to the Jewish people, a sense of belonging to the Jewish community. A second is a commitment to the state of Israel and to its growth and to its safety and security. A third value is a sense of inclusivity, that every Jew on the face of the earth has a part and a role to play in our community. And the fourth value is tikkun olam, helping to repair the world, helping to make the world a better place. We invest lots as a foundation of time and resources in bringing people together to inspiring and encouraging young people. To teach them to believe in themselves, to dare to think out of the box, and to have the courage to be different and to stick to what they believe in. The idea is to dream big and to believe, have a belief in yourself that you actually can make a difference in the world and you can change things. And it shouldn't be small, but dream really, really big. And don't just dream about it, don't just think about it, but actually implement it and move forward and bring others along with you. So we say to young people, build it. Build the community that you care about. Make the friends, make the connections that you care about. It's about bringing people together. It's helping people meet one another, to exchange ideas and information, to network, to really come together and become a community. And we found that a lot of times, especially today, that people really miss the one-on-one -on -one relationship of being able to have a conversation like you and I are having, look each other in the eye, tell somebody that you care about them, understand what's going on in their lives and forming a relationship and how vitally important personal relationships are. What makes you tick? Why are you all committed to the Jewish world? And we realize that if a single person, if they link arm in arm with someone else and build a community to achieve an objective, the power is awesome. I'm optimistic about the young people being able to change the world because the technological resources are, have, are, is unparalleled. We're just scratching the surface of the way in which we can help each other make the world a better place. The opportunity to make great change has never been larger than it is today. Somebody came to Charlie and they said, well, aren't you really afraid about doing this? And he said, no. I've drilled dry holes before, so I don't think this is going to be a dry hole, but I'm, I'm fine and I'm on board for it. So he always, in a way, thought out of the box, moved ahead and was not, didn't look back, was not afraid to drill that dry hole. And even when we didn't have very much money, like in 1967, we went to the bank and borrowed $500 to uh, commit to the state of Israel. So we've always had a belief in trying to give back and hopefully today we're continuing that forward and part of why we do what we do with the young people, we're taking a risk and we're believing in them and we're giving them a future and a hope for the future. And do you think young people have the answers? I'm betting on it. <laughs>